The executive management said that it was extremely concerned about crime on its campuses. It is said as part of the findings of a security assessment done last year, the institution has approved a budget of 30 million rand in funding for security upgrades and security related technology. It is also in the process of procuring the services of a new security service provider and is to introduce a new security plan. The university management denied allegations that the institution had not made available video footage of the attack on Dovo. The student was stabbed in the head while studying in a lecture room. The university said while it didn't have CCTV footage of the actual attack, it had provided police with footage of Nlovu and other students before the attack. During the course of this week, we procured the new cameras that will be finalized in terms of installation before the end of this week. So those are security measures that we have actually put in place to try and eliminate all the fears that staff and students may have in terms of their safety within the university. Meanwhile, students and friends of University of KwaZulu-Natal student Snetemba Ndlovu have organized a night vigil to mourn her passing. The 22-year-old student was attacked and stabbed at an event in Msinga at the weekend and died of her injuries in hospital. Epsilim Kize, SABC News, Durban.